Hey folks, welcome back to NetCruiser channel. Today I have some tech to show you from my friends at Aki. The last Aki lighting product that I showed was this really cool lamp, and these are still available. I love this thing. It's really cool. It's portable, it's LED, you can articulate it in any direction. Go see my video on that. It's really neat. Now this one though, it's white only. So there's brightness, but it only does one color. So I have something new to show you today from my friends at Aki. All right, an unboxing. This is the Aki touch control LED lamp. And not only is it LED, it's RGB. So this lamp will be able to do all different colors and it's also a touch base. So let's get into it. Okay, now this one is gonna be a little bit different and then it's not wireless. So it doesn't have a battery. It will require to be plugged into a wall the whole time. So the first thing that came out is probably the charge adapter. It is, and it is uh, a North American style plug. Is there stats on it? The plug is 0.2 amp in AC, and it puts out 12 volt, six amp for DC. Get a user manual and the Aki key. Something I never mentioned in all my other Aki videos, this is actually a sticker and you're supposed to peel off and put the sticker of a key on whatever you want and then take a picture and hashtag it with uh, all Aki products come with a long warranty and customer support. And a lamp and a big base of foam. So let's get the foam off. Let's get the packaging aside. Okay. All right has a little bit of a silicone ring around the base here. It is model number LTT6. It puts out 450 lumens and uses six watts. Base is touch, capacitive touch. Let's just plug it in and see how it works. Just gonna undo the twist tie here. The, the top is, it's a plastic. This base is metal, however, because it is capacitive touch. I'm gonna put you in my hand. There is a little, oh, that's interesting. So the, the plug is off to the side of where the front is. So when you're looking at it from the front, you see the plug. I wish that was sticking at the very back. All right, one touch on. It's got a nice glow to it. The camera seems to be picking up as a lot brighter on the bottom than it does on the top. And that is true, but the color temperature that I'm seeing is a lot more warm than what you're seeing in the camera. Touch again, ooh, brighter, brightest, off. Now, color changing, press and hold, red, it's cycling, now it's cycling colors. That's pretty neat. Let's go through the full color cycle here. blues. It's going into a purple now. Red, once it hits red spectrum, it's an abrupt changeover to red, but everything else has been very smooth so far. And I think when you get to a color that you like, you just tap it and it will stay there. And then if I want to Tap again, it's continued its cycle. Tap to stop, tap and hold, powers it off. Tap once to turn on, it goes back to candlelight white. Low, medium, high. And then when you switch over to the color mode, press and tap and hold, and there is no brightness control for colors. I would say that that's low to medium brightness for colors. Just a quick follow up on the touch RGB lamp from Aki. I also have a Aki diffuser, which I've never showed before, and it also does RGB lighting. I wanted to check the brightness. The light is on the diffuser right now, and it is a little bit darker than the lamp. So the lamp, like I said, in color mode, it only has one luminance. And I'll just turn it off right now, and that's the example of the diffuser. 
Now, something else I've noticed with the lamp, when you first touch it on once in the candlelight mode, it makes a very noticeable electronic hum. That's the only mode that it does it in, in its lowest power mode. Once you move it up into medium brightness, it totally goes away. I can't hear it anymore. High, can't hear it. And in color mode, you can't hear it. I have the type of hearing that notices those high pitch electronic frequencies all the time. You may not notice it, but if you are the type of person that can hear that, and I don't know if the camera will be able to pick up on it. You may be able to hear that. Anyway, other than that, great lamp. All right, so that's the Aki LED desk lamp. And you can get one of these from Amazon.com or Amazon.ca, and I'll put a link in the description. Thanks for watching.